Imagine standing before a mirror that does more than reflect your face. It opens a window into the very beginning of the universe. In that reflection, you do not see stars or planets, but the faint glow of the first light ever created. It feels less like looking outward and more like looking backward through time itself. This idea has fascinated scientists for decades. They often describe it as trying to witness the moment everything first awakened. Space, matter, and energy were just starting to exist, and nothing yet had a familiar shape. Even the physical laws we depend on today were still settling into place. In those earliest moments, the universe was not calm or organized. It was raw, unstable, and changing rapidly. There were no galaxies, no suns, and no worlds. Everything that exists now was only a possibility, waiting to form. For many years, astronomers dreamed of a tool powerful enough to see that far back. They imagined a telescope that could capture the oldest light in existence, light that has traveled for billions of years through expanding space. That dream eventually became real. The James Webb Space Telescope, correctly called JWST, was designed for this purpose. It was built to see farther, sharper, and deeper than any telescope before it. Some scientists jokingly called it a time machine pointed at the sky. When JWST first opened its massive golden mirror, expectations were modest. Researchers believed they would see a quiet, young universe. They expected thin clouds of gas drifting slowly, beginning the long process of forming stars. Early galaxies were predicted to be small and chaotic. Scientists imagined shapeless structures with no clear organization. These galaxies were thought to be cosmic infants, still learning how to grow and evolve. But the universe had other plans. What JWST revealed shocked nearly everyone involved. Instead of faint clouds, it showed fully formed galaxies shining brightly across time. Some of these galaxies displayed spiral arms similar to our Milky Way. Others had dense, glowing centers packed with stars. A few even contained supermassive black holes, objects once believed to take billions of years to form. It felt like expecting to meet toddlers and instead finding adults. Astronomers were stunned. A universe only a few hundred million years old should not have had time to build such complexity. As more data arrived, the surprises continued. JWST detected more early galaxies than predicted, and many were far brighter and heavier than existing theories allowed. Instead of small sparks of light, scientists were seeing massive cosmic structures. Dr. Garth Illingworth described the discovery as a plot twist in a story we thought we understood. Dr. Emma Chapman explained that the data forced scientists to rethink nearly every assumption about early galaxy formation. These reactions were not dramatic exaggerations. Some galaxies were observed just 400 million years after the Big Bang. On a cosmic scale, that is unbelievably early. To put it into perspective, if the universe were a human lifespan, this would be like finding someone who had already finished college while still an infant. It suggested galaxies grew up to ten times faster than expected. The early universe was not slow or gentle. It was active, crowded, and incredibly productive. This realization changed how scientists viewed cosmic evolution. Another shock came from the materials inside these galaxies. JWST detected carbon, oxygen, iron, and other heavy elements. These elements are forged inside stars and spread through space when stars explode as supernovae. For heavy elements to exist, multiple generations of stars must already have lived and died. 
that process usually takes billions of years. Yet JWST found these materials in galaxies only a few hundred million years old. Many scientists struggled to explain this. It was like discovering a fully developed city moments after laying the first brick. The implication was clear. Star formation was far more intense than previously imagined. Dr. Priya Natarajan described the early universe as a cosmic fireworks show. She suggested stars were forming, burning, and exploding at extraordinary speeds. Others proposed that our understanding of time itself in the early universe might need revision. Conditions back then may have allowed processes to happen faster than modern models allow. Then came perhaps the most puzzling discovery of all. JWST detected huge black holes at the centers of young galaxies. One was estimated to be over a billion times the mass of our Sun. According to traditional theories, black holes grow slowly by consuming gas and stars over millions or billions of years. But this black hole already existed when the universe was extremely young. Even advanced computer simulations could not explain it. Scientists began exploring bold new ideas to solve the mystery. Some proposed that early black holes formed directly from massive collapsing gas clouds, skipping the star phase entirely. Others suggested that dark matter played a stronger role, pulling matter together faster than expected. Dr. Mitchell Begelman noted that scientists may be missing a crucial ingredient in understanding early black hole growth. These were not small corrections to existing ideas. They were discoveries powerful enough to rewrite astronomy textbooks. The universe now appeared more energetic, more creative, and more complex than anyone had predicted. The early cosmos was not just expanding and cooling. It was building structures, testing possibilities, and evolving rapidly. JWST revealed a universe full of ambition. Another fascinating discovery involved organic molecules drifting freely through space. These molecules are essential building blocks for amino acids, which are critical for life. What shocked scientists was that these molecules were not attached to planets or stars. They floated alone, like seeds scattered across the cosmos. This raised an exciting possibility. If life's ingredients existed so early and were widespread, then life itself may not be rare. It could be a natural outcome of cosmic evolution. Dr. Natalie Batalla stated that this discovery suggests life might emerge wherever conditions allow. It also hints that planets may not be required for early chemical development. Space itself may have acted as a cradle for life's beginnings. This idea challenges long-held assumptions about where life can start. JWST also observed galaxies with unusual shapes. Some appeared almost flower-like, displaying striking symmetry. One explanation involves gravitational lensing, where massive objects bend light like a cosmic magnifying glass. But some scientists believe these shapes hint at deeper patterns. Dr. Joseph Silk described the symmetry as both beautiful and puzzling. He suggested there may be hidden structures guiding galaxy formation. This idea connects to mysteries in quantum physics. In quantum experiments, observation can influence outcomes. Some researchers wonder if similar principles apply on cosmic scales. It is not that observing the universe changes it. Rather, observation may reveal patterns that were always present but previously invisible. When galaxies form earlier than expected, black holes grow faster than predicted, and molecules appear before planets, it points to a universe full of unexpected creativity. JWST has shown that the cosmos is not silent or empty. It is active, energetic, and constantly surprising.
Dr. Brian Keating described the experience as being handed a familiar universe with new instructions. Everything from galaxy growth to chemical timelines is being reconsidered. Students learning astronomy today may soon study models that will be replaced. Science is adjusting in real time. With every new image, the universe feels more alive. It feels like a story unfolding chapter by chapter. The deeper we look, the more we realize how much remains unknown. The most important discoveries may still be hidden in the faintest light. Each revelation also changes how we see ourselves. If complexity appeared early, then creativity is part of the universe's nature. If life's ingredients were everywhere, then we may not be as alone as once believed. If patterns appear almost designed, deeper rules may exist. Scientists believe the next JWST discoveries may be even more dramatic. They expect more early black holes, strange chemicals, and galaxies that challenge every rule. Dr. Jane Rigby said working with JWST feels like rediscovering the universe. Many scientists agree that astronomy has entered a new era. What began as a mission to look back in time has become a mission to rethink everything. The universe no longer feels distant. It feels alive, unfolding, and full of meaning. As we learn about distant galaxies, we also learn about ourselves. In the end, the James Webb Space Telescope has done more than take pictures. It has reminded humanity that discovery never ends. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.